Hey everybody, welcome to a new vlog. It is Thursday, January 16th. It's the 16th, wow. That means three months to my birthday. Any other Aries out there? So basically it is the first day of the second semester of my senior year. And I'm starting it in a way that I never thought I would. If you saw my last vlog, you'll know that I broke my ankle and now, I'm in a wheelchair. And if you're wondering why I'm not on crutches, it's because they gave me crutches, but this angle that I'm walking on, I, I broke before and it's really bad. And so I can only get like three steps on the crutches without feeling like tired or like can't walk. And the thought of like going to my classes like that, it intimidated me basically. So I borrowed my friend MH's wheelchair. Shout out to MH. Thank you for letting me borrow your wheelchair. And we're just gonna do the day like this. Now I only have two classes today, thank God. I have French and I have stage combat which is like stage fighting and I can't take that right now in this. So that's gonna be fun to see, you know, what's gonna make of that. I am also taking yoga this year, not today, but I'm wondering what that professor will say as well. So it's gonna be an interesting day. Hey y'all, so I'm back where I started. Wow, I didn't think my tears would do this. Back where I started, um, I couldn't even make it to class. Um, First of all, my class is on the whole other campus. And my wheelchair couldn't fit in my friend's car, so I couldn't go. And right now, I'm just feeling like a little bit sad and a little bit helpless, like I can't do anything for myself, which isn't a fun feeling at all. And like, I don't have like a boyfriend or anything, you know, that can just like it's that person's duty to drop everything to take care of me. I don't know. I'm not gonna keep crying on camera though because that's not what I want my channel to be. But it looks like I'm just not gonna go to classes today, which sucks because it's my, it's my last first day. I can't even go, but it's okay. I'm just gonna rest. Hey y'all, so I know y'all saw earlier that I was having a really tough day today. My dad actually came down and good news is I made a doctor's appointment to put on my like permanent cast, so that's good, but something really just cheered me up, you guys. Y'all, my friends Christy and Andrew, they left me this really sweet get well soon package. It's so cute. Christy and Andrew, I love this so much. It literally means the world to me. Like, it cheered me up like no other. This is so sweet. So I wanted to thank y'all. Oh my God. This is really like, this really makes me feel better from earlier. Hey y'all, so right now it is the morning of Friday the 17th. And I'm on the way to go with my dad. I'm like wheeling and vlogging. I'm on the way to go with my dad to the doctor to, so they can put my permanent cast on. So stay tuned, this is like a little ride. It's fun for like five seconds and then you're like, I am annoyed. <laughs> hey y'all, okay. So I know that I was supposed to leave the doctor's office with a permanent cast on. And I was excited to show you. I actually, when they were cutting off my splint cast, asked if I could film and the lady said no, it would be against HIPAA rules, which HIPAA is like their, um, the confidentiality clause, whatever. But there was no need for me to film anyway because the doctor came in and told me that I would need surgery for my ankle. Pretty urgent surgery, it's next Wednesday. So this is gonna be the very first time i ever sorry my lashes look pretty good today i curled them today they look pretty nice i have never had surgery ever in my life in my 21 years of life almost 22 and i'm very scared you guys like i'm really really scared and you know i was gonna do a whole video but but when i'm out of surgery i will have a cast so I will still do my cast video, like I was saying. It's just gonna take a little bit longer than I anticipated. I just can't believe that I need surgery. Like when I first broke it, I really thought I sprained it. I was like, this is just like a really harsh sprain. I'm sure it's nothing more, nothing less. Well, 
it is something more. But that's okay, we're taking care of it and my healing time will be much quicker. So that's good, that's really good. And I'm getting like metal plates. It's like the whole nine, you guys. So it's kind of a big deal, but I get to leave the same day. I don't have to stay overnight or anything. Like my leg's gonna be numb. So apparently the pain afterwards won't be like horrible, you know? Well, like, I'm pretty, pretty optimistic about it. My dad's trying to get me one of those scooters. You know those scooters you can like put your knee on and then you go he's trying to get me one of those so we're at walgreens right now he went in to see if they have one so i'll keep you upgraded on that because y'all know me i'm gonna pimp my ride and my new cricket is supposed to be here today so hopefully if it is i can pimp it out i also got some sweatpants from ross to like fit over the splint i think i'm gonna iron on some stuff on there with my press and everything so hopefully i can get some good videos pumped out before i have surgery and everything but Luckily, I've still got some stuff to look forward to. I've got the improv competition on Saturday tomorrow, so that's good. I don't know if I told you guys, but I co-direct an improv team, and we have competition on Saturday tomorrow. Um, and at first, I was afraid I wasn't going to be able to go, but I can still go. So I'm not, like, playing or anything. So, yeah, I still got that, y'all. It's been a struggle. Hello, everybody. Okay, so I am back from being seen by the doctor and like out with my dad and everything. My dad left. My dad is so sweet. Handsome is so spoiled by his grandparents. I'm telling you guys, like my mom used to feed him out of a wine glass, like give him his water out of a wine glass and would give him milk as a treat when he was a baby. And now my dad, look what he bought him. He bought him a, an electric litter box. Let me show you guys how it works. So this litter box, which he has yet to use because he's like, what? It's like an automatic timer five minutes well we have it set to 20 minutes after he poops this thing which it'll know because he'll step on this this will go down and click and you see that number one that was because we rigged it automatically we like tried out ourselves but once it clicks it'll be like oh he just used it so it'll do like the little shh which i will show you guys now like it's gonna say two now because we're gonna go ahead and make it do it but like look how cool this thing thing is handsome it's your new toy Look, look baby boy. He's like, oh my God. Look Angel, do you like it? Sorry y'all, that's the Simpsons in the background. But yeah, he bought him this automatic litter box. Well, the litter box, if you have a cat, if you're a cat mom or dad, you know that if your litter box is a hood, which that's what I prefer, and you'll know why that's on a towel in a minute. If it has a hood, then you're supposed to leave the hood off if it's a new litter box for the first couple of days, because then your cat will like go to automatically, and then once you add that hood on, your cat will know. So, well, I did tell you guys um, in my unboxing video for the Cricut Easy Press 2 that I am a big aesthetics person. I like themes i like styles like specific and wow look at that pen on my thing from the doctor's office i like style i like specific style for certain people so of course handsome has an aesthetic and handsome's is like blues browns grays and like very dapper very like i'm a gentleman i'm very sweet that's his like personality he's not like a thug he's like super nice <laughs> sorry the Simpsons are getting on my nerves so what i think i'm going to do is I am going to spray paint this hood and the little step stool because it will go with his look. And I have spray painted a litter box from before, not his most recent one, but another one um, for his first birthday. And I have some of the paint left over and I think this is perfect to go with that, like, uh-oh, it fell, to go with that brown. Now, I know what you all are thinking. Alexia, if you're gonna spray paint, why are you inside? I looked it up and the Krylon spray paint, you can spray, spray inside. I'm very scared. I can't go outside because I am bound to my chair and like all of the exits and stuff are like, they have chairs and everything, like it's weird. So, or they have stairs, sorry, not chairs. So I have to do it inside. I hope it doesn't stink up the place too much. I think it should be fine. I've got the fan going. We're good. So I'm gonna get started on spray painting this. Hopefully Hanson won't touch it. Hello, everyone. 
everybody. Okay, so I'm sure you're wondering where the heck are you? If you've been watching my vlogs for a little while, you'll recognize that right now I am at home in what used to be my childhood bedroom. And I bet you're wondering like, why the heck aren't you at the improv competition? Well, that was yesterday. Today is Sunday the 19th. And yesterday was the competition, but my ankle was really bothering me and so my parents decided to bring me home you know it's it's gonna be a time I think I've been underestimating how serious this injury is like incredibly like and I think I think it's just better for me to you know just come home and I'll be here until I recover from surgery, which luckily the recovery time is only a week. Like I, I only have to like, I mean the whole recovery time is only a week, but I only have to be like on bed rest. Like luckily I don't have to stay the night at the hospital, but I only have to be on like bed rest for a week. So that's good. And you know, I mean, it's hard. It's really hard because like when you, if you've had like a serious injury, like I, I thought of this like as like a sprain at first, like when it first happened to me, I was like, this isn't that serious. Like I hurt my ankle, okay. But like, I'll insert a picture of the x-ray here. Like my leg looks like somebody broke a chopstick in half. Like it's pretty bad. And it's, it's something that can only be healed by surgery. And like, I have like, tendons that are broken if I'm pronouncing that tendons tendons if I'm butchering that I am so sorry but it's pretty bad but I am making the most of it I'm using the time that I'm recovering to definitely revamp my YouTube channel and like when I'm done recovering I don't I just want to put all my energy in this channel and everything and actually like I know I said earlier in the vlog that I'm definitely doing my cast video, but I just want to reiterate, I'm definitely doing that cast video. My cast should be on in like a week and I have big plans for it. Because y'all know me, I am a crafter. I, I like to personalize things. I like to, everything to be cute. I like everything to go with my little look. And I know that's not necessarily like the best place to put my energy, but that's where I'm putting it. Who's gonna say, who's gonna check me, boo? So basically, um, I am at home for a while. I definitely want, you know, to spend time with you guys in that time. Um, so that's that's what's gonna happen and I wanted to show you guys the finished product of Hanson's litter box which he's been using I'm so proud of him if you have a cat you know it's like you have to gradually train them and he's catch on fast so let me show it to you guys that's the finished product you see I spray painted the hood and the um the little step stool and I think it came out pretty good it's not my best work definitely like if you see the other side it's not that bad but like it's definitely not bad and it's definitely like cute but I've spray painted things much more evenly in my past. But I really like how it turned out. And I'm gonna put his name on that like top ledge there. Say hello. Say hello, everybody. Say hi. He's like, girl, get that camera out of my face. But um, yeah, it definitely came out really cute. All right, hey y'all. So it is Tuesday, January 21st, right? Yep, January 21st the day before my surgery, my very first surgery in my life. And I'm really, really nervous. I was going to like, you know, film me going into the hospital, like having the thing on so that I could like put it in the vlog. But the way that, the way that they acted about, you know, my cast and like them just taking off my splint cast, like I don't think they're gonna let me film or anything and so I wanted to make sure I got the vlog out before I had the surgery so today I am gonna go to the nail salon because I have to take my SNS off look I have these black pants and they were new so they dyed them it's not terrible but they're getting taken off and hopefully I get them redone after I'm done recovering and everything and go have surgery and I am so nervous I'm like so 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 nervous I've never had surgery a day in my life and to kick things off y'all literally Last night, my dad brought me home some Applebee's, right? So good. It was the salmon, broccoli, fries, and the spinach dip. If you know me, you know. I love spinach dip. I had it for the first time last summer, and ever since then, like, I am an addict, right? So, literally, I have the spinach dip, everything, whatever. You know, I eat it. I took a bath, and, like, literally, as soon as I got out of the bath, my stomach started, like, tossing and turning. And, you guys, I think I have, like, a mild food poisoning. <laughs> Because last night, like, I don't want to get into TMI, but like, let's just say I was in the bathroom for a really long time. And then this morning, I feel like this isn't about to say, I threw up. I threw up this morning. So, hopefully, 
I am okay by the end of the day. Even right now, like my stomach, you know how when you go through your stomach and she just kind of feels like, that's what it feels like right now. Like I feel like I need something on my stomach because it's like that feeling where you're like, oh, I'm gonna throw up, but there's nothing to throw up. So yeah, but I think I'm gonna end the vlog here. I am really scared y'all, but I'm gonna be fine. I'm gonna be fine. If you like this video, leave me a like. You can follow me on Instagram, Lexi.Desiree. Um, it's in my description. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe if you feel so compelled. All right, I love you. Bye. Say bye, handsome. Where's handsome at? Handsome. Handsome's asleep, so I'll say bye for both of us.